fancy rebound of the Wildcats. They've had a couple of those already. Mooney, good enough to score. Same side. There's Trev. Last pass for Cotton. And oh. Mooney rolls to the cup with the dunk. Welcome to the game, Mooney. Welcome. <laughs> In with the two hands. And that's just a little slow in the rotation there. Scotty Hobson needed. Mooney stepping out. He's a good three-point shooter for a big man. A good. 28 of 33 this season. Normal average is, but I think that Dean would be more concerned about what's going on the defensive end. It's Mooney, tough wraparound to start off. Golding that can just come out and take matters into his own hands from really deep and like that one. It makes a tough, beautifully executed play. And the closeouts are coming a little late. That time, Todd Blanchfield, Dean Bickerman can see that he was wide open. And again, Mooney wide open from the three-point line and drains it. Fails him out with a three ball. Compared to what we see here. Flex cut, flex cut, three ball, money. Flex cut. For Melbourne United. Norton sees his part to the basket. Luala Chul blocked the shot, but Mooney was there. It's better than a turnover. Shoot it. We might get an offensive rebound. But you can't turn the ball over every time, Rudy. Really. He's had a couple in this quarter, and it has a team. Defense work with all their man and ball movement, which helps the Perth Wildcats on the defensive end just as much as their actual defense. Oh, my Lord. And that's 30. A 30-piece, 14 ball.